Is it time to buy or sell Ideonomic stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Ideonomics. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, July 5, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since June 30, 2023, our system has ranked Ideonomics as a buy candidate, giving it a score of 2.73. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. Those who followed our analysis would have enjoyed an impressive gain of 22.55% since we first listed Ideonomics as a buy candidate three days ago. This translates to an average return of 7.52% per day since it was listed as buy candidate. The stock lies in the middle of a very wide and strong rising trend in the short term and a further rise within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 34.66% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 34.29% and 57.03%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 89.93% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 100% and minus 91.72%. This translates to a price range of $0 to $0.0076 after a year. Our latest daily update for Ideonomics includes the headline, Ideonomic stock price up more than 7.41% on Wednesday. The Ideonomic stock price gained 7.41% on the last trading day, Wednesday, July 5, 2023 rising from $0.0850 to $0.0913. It has now gained three days in a row. It will be exciting to see whether it manages to continue gaining or take a minor break for the next few days. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 8.57% from a day low at $0.0875 to a day high of $0.0950. The price has fallen in 7 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 10.4% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day along with the price, which is a positive technical sign, and, in total, 3 million more shares were traded than the day before. In total, 59 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $5.37 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $0.770, and the lowest price was $0.0210. Currently, the price is 88.14%, or $0.679, below the 52-week high, and 98.7%, or $6.91, below the all-time high on December 20, 2017 when the price reached $7. Analysts have given Ideonomic stock a general neutral rating. They rate the P-E ratio as buy and price to book as buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong sell rating. The following signals have been identified for Ideonomics. The Ideonomic stock holds by signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $0.0829 and $0.0649. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. Volume is rising along with the price. This is considered to be a good technical signal. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, June 20, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 10.40%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. 
Moving average convergence divergence, sell signal. Pivots, sell signal 11 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 62 days ago. Short term moving average, buy signal 3 days ago. Long term moving average, buy signal 21 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 20 days ago. If we look at the 12 month chart we see. Short moving average, buy signal 3 days ago. The long term moving average, buy signal 2 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Holds a sell signal. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, risk, and stop loss for Ideonomics. On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $0.0850 and $0.0823. There is a natural risk involved when a stock is testing a support level, since if this is broken, the stock then may fall to the next support level. In this case, Ideonomics finds support just below today's level at $0.0850. If this is broken, then the next support from accumulated volume will be at $0.0823 and $0.0715. This stock may move very much during the day, volatility, and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.0075 between high and low, or 8.57%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 13.77%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Ideonomics, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. A negative PE ratio means the company has negative earnings or is losing money. Even established companies experience down periods, often due to factors beyond their control. However, consistently negative P-E ratios may signal insufficient profit and possible bankruptcy risks. In other news, the next earnings report for Q3 2023 is expected on NOV 07, 2023. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Ideonomics. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Ideonomics is at $0.0922. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Ideonomics encounters its first support level at $0.0850. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Ideonomics from multiple analyst sources is neutral. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On September 16, 2022, Johnston Stephen Eric conducted an insider sell of zero shares of common stock. On October 21, 2022, Poor Alfred conducted an insider buy of 400,000 shares of common stock, $0.001 par value per share. On January 21, 2022, Poor Alfred conducted an insider buy of 19,775 shares of common stock, $0.001 par value per share. On January 20, 2022, Poor Alfred conducted an insider buy of 14,500 shares of common stock, $0.001 par value per share. On January 12, 2022, Poor Alfred conducted an insider buy of 25 shares of common stock, $0.001 par value per share. Based on the 88 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 39.282. Overall, insiders purchased 31,122,003 shares and sold 630,153,584 shares in the last 88 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $0.0858, minus 6%. This stock has very high daily movements and this gives very high risk. There is a sell signal from a pivot top found 10 days ago.
Is Ideonomics stock a good buy? Several short-term signals, along with a general good trend, are positive and we conclude that the current level may hold a buying opportunity as there is a fair chance for Ideonomics stock to perform well in the short term. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Thursday, July 6, we expect Ideonomics to open down $0.00003333 and start trading at $0.0913. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.